Another interesting tool in a mesh move menu is it is uh, set flow and equal spacing. If you're going to the edge mode, it's these tools work in edge mode only. <clears throat> equal spacing and uh, set flow here. As you can see, they are for selecting edges, edge loops. So we select all the objects in the scene. As you can see, we have selected some uh, edges. First, I want to select this strip. As you can see, we have a curvature in the beginning and the end of this uh, strip in the pipe. <clears throat> and I want to uh, set these loops that I selected with shift exactly follow this flow or the curvature. Okay. You can uh, right click and access this set flu or click in here. As you can see, it's sitting really up here, here and just click and drag. As you can see, it's very interesting. It's, uh, like a tangent, it's set its flu here. If you want, you can equal a spacing between them. As you can see, it's equal a spacing. Or if you want, you can make it linear only. Interesting. And the maximum angle is for such this situation here. Select this cube. No, this cube here. First, you have to select the edges that you want to with double click and shift. As you can see, uh, we have an curvature or a brick down here. And we want to these curves follow this flow or this curve. Select that and just click and drag. As you can see, try to make this topology exactly to this, this situation. But if you see this angle, this angle is exactly this. There's a 19 an angle here. You can change the angle to uh, see the different results. I want. I don't want to go to mathematical changing, but you can change the, ang the angle. For example, below this 90, it's act like this. More than angle, it's act like this just okay or the zero okay or in this situation as you can see it detected this uh, object as a curvature and if you click and drag it tries to as you can see make this set this flow here or the curvature Interesting. It try to set this curvature continuously to this area. For the tool for this sitting the fall back modes, it's when the object, when the tool does not recognize a curvature. For example, in this situation, we have the original initial object is here. Uh, this fall off is in off this is an edge and this is a normal okay you can set it when the up uh, the tool does not recognize a uh, curvature for beginning or the ending of that edges that you selected another interesting tool is equal spacing for example we select these loops here the holding them shift and you can set it equal the spacing just click and drag it tries to equalize the spacing between the the loop that's selected or you can make it linear it's very simple and that's it if you have as you can see it's try to equal a spacing with the loops that you selected Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now, you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.